Oh shit. Rid of that. Mario Luigi cutscene. Yoshi what? Blue toe, blue toe. Welcome to the there Flower you. Kingdom. The Flower not Kingdom. So distant land, just beyond the Toadette, Mushroom there Kingdom. Toadette, there founder. Yes. Mario and friends were invited here by Prince the benevolent Florian. Prince Florian. Wait, is that his name in the anime? The King of the Koopas had other plans. With just a single touch of the mysterious Wonder Flower. Ah, uh, that sucks. It's just Bowser. No one's pulling the strings. He's just. Wonderfied. Bowser merged with Prince Florian's castle. Whoa. He merged with the castle. Yo, the Yoshi's Island enemy. Like the piranha plant thing. That thing is massive. What the hell? I think people were hoping that it would have like the scope of a 3D Mario game as well. Interesting. Power, chaos spread across the land. Now it's up to Mario and friends to stop Bowser. Yeah, flower let's do it. Yo, damn it, let's go! I called it. Yeah. Everybody's here, literally. In this presentation. We'll go over what's new in Mario's latest 2D side-scrolling adventure, I called the it. Super Mario Brothers Wonder Game. Bro, Let's Toadette, go. Nabbit, everybody, Jesus. This is the Flower Kingdom. Whoa. It's made up of six distinct worlds. That oh, I think you can lives. fully control because Mario stopped there. Yo, explore. it's all connected. Seven Your areas. Begins among the tubular hills of Pipe Rock Plateau. Whoa. Once you get past the Fluff freezing puff. foot of the mountain, you'll be aiming for new heights in Fluff Puff Peaks. I think it's like a shining Many fault. Whoa. Amidst the picturesque scenery and radiant cascades of shining A lot of new enemies, a lot of new enemies. Traverse multiple islands. Had a lot, a lot of, it seems like it's a lot of mix. Like, yeah, see, Petal Isles. Yeah, so there's... There's more than just one theme. With white sand as far as the eye can see. An uncanny forest lined with giant mushrooms. A scorching hot world full of molten magma and more. A Yo, fire spikes. Of await in each world. Move around the map in each world to select a course. Okay, whoa. You can even walk freely through open areas you find. Why? That seems so strange, but this is exactly how I called it in the pr our podcast as well. Instead. There's certain sections play that you can walk open you world. Like. Once you play the course, play in any open world. Come back to it through the courses. That is so it's nice. An easy way to find the ones you want to play that again. is so convenient. Wow. While in courses, you might notice some talking flowers. <laughs> You might notice some annoying little oh, bitches. <laughs> How do you get up here? What a pretty sunset. They'll talk to you, livening up your adventure. Uh, yeah. It's like. very like Super Princess pants. Peach, actually. You can get over there. That's kind of cool, though. You'd share your water with me? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, characters. Besides oh, Mario, you can also play. My ice. God. Blue Tuff. Luigi, Daisy, Daisy, one of two toads, one of two, and Toadette. Daisy. We all play the same, so go with your favorite. Oh, uh, I love how he said that. The Yoshi's and Nabbit, on the other hand, uh, will take damage. Gotcha. It is easy mode. Easy going. Cool. Understandable. Careful though, they'll still lose a life if they fall down a pit. So watch your step. Fair. Additionally, the Yoshis can flutter jump, eat objects, and spit them back at enemies. Ah, uh, so they're the only ones with the exclusive abilities. Speaking of enemies, here are some of the new ones you'll find. Hoppy cats will copy the player and jump when what? you jump. That those are just the pip squeaks, what? Melon piranha plants will spit seeds from Yo, house. from Yoshi's Island. That's dope. Well, Cone not exactly, will but you and stick their beaks where they don't belong. And very similar when to a 3D Mario enemy. Goo. 
Interesting. Be unraveled if you position yourself just right. Nice. That's pretty cool. Mamas will eat anything that comes too close to <laughs> mamas. Oh, they're kind of cute. More new enemies for you to discover as well. Goombas. <laughs> Koopa Troopas. Hey. I love all the animations. And other familiar foes are also here. Oh my god, Dick! What? Next, let's look at the new power. It is a 3D. That is a 3D Mario ability. Form. What? Make the most of your nose and your size. Swing your trunk to attack enemies. Destroy blocks and even do this. Oh, that's so cool. In this form, you can easily break through blocks and dash across large gaps. See? So this is one that is like an actual power, but it's not like exclusive to a level. Spray it out. Who knows what might happen? Thank you. That is that so cool. Sure is useful, huh? It's not just Mario though. Luigi. Uh oh. The Toads. Oh no. Hey, uh. Oh no. Peach, ah! Ah! All have ah! forms as well. Oh no. Ah! The bubble form allows This is basically the baby Yoshi. Bubbles. I hate Peach. To capture and defeat enemies oh, literally distance. exactly like the baby Yoshi. Also drift toward nearby foes. Also, I I still no no I don't I don't like knock out baddies on the other side I don't like elephant um jump off them like platforms I don't I don't like elephant um peach to reach places just like that nice the drill form you'll get a pretty nifty drill this makes no flying ability or hard-headed enemies of breeze nice or you can use it to drill down it also allows you to burrow and move through the ground that's in dope a tough spot dig in a away. tough spot bro you can even yo into the ceiling. that sounds like mario world that's crazy whoa i wasn't expecting company <laughs> plus the classic fire form makes a return any other returning ones Oh, and you can hang on to an extra power up. Okay, I figured pitch, that. Bust out a power up. Small Daisy. <laughs> wow, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> please make that a meme. Also, that's the only this returning power up. Wonder flower, Oof. A plant that grows in the flower kingdom. It's like literally anything else. This world's mysterious power. Not that I'm complaining, but even new Super Mario Bros. U. Yeah, just so you didn't know. When you touch a wonder, the titular, you know, item here. A wonder effect will trigger, causing some interesting changes. Pipes might start moving. A stampede of enemies can appear. God, Yoshi looks so cursed. Ever so slightly. Free fall. Bubbles might uh bubble up. Nice. Your perspective. Whoa. A top down perspective. Or you might float through space. Yay, space. They brought it back. Your character transforms. Okay. Mario might become a Goomba. Yeah, that's what we saw with Toad, right? Or a spike ball. Yay. No cappy. Or blow up like a balloon. <gasps> the pea balloon. Wonder flower. Always expect. Hey. Wonderful. Wonderful. Wonder seed, and the course will return to normal. Okay. Some courses need to be unlocked using the wonder seeds. You've okay, collected. so like green stars. Okay, gotcha. You'll also earn a wonder seed as thanks from a poplin when you clear a course. Nice. Okay, a poplin. That's what, okay. Okay, so there's one in the level, and then one you get at the end of the stage. Gotcha. Badges are uh, stamps, essentially. You'll unlock in-game badges that change up the way you play when equipped. Really? There are a variety of badges, each with its own special ability. Let's Actually, go some of them. That's kind Slow of cool. With the parachute cap badge. Oh, it's a badge. Oh, you can have it at any time. Jumping abilities with the wall climb jump badge. This is completely different. They finally evolved the 2D Mario formula. The dolphin kick badge. 
You can also break underwater blocks. Oh Shards my god. A bounding leap with the crouching high jump badge. What the hell is Shoot happening? Vines in midair and stick to walls with the grappling vine badge. You can just be Spider-Man. drops instantly okay. with the safety bounce badge. A lot of returning Easily features from Toadette and, and stuff. Using the sensor badge. Draw in nearby Mula with the coin badge. Mula. Become invisible to your enemies and yourself with the invisibility uh, badge. Don't know how that helps, but kind of creative. Dashing with the jet run badge. Yo, and Jet. You can run in the air for a bit. There are many more badges with different abilities, from the convenient uh, to the unconventional. I like how they Only said there's many more badges per course. Equip them from the world map or when starting a course. Or if you don't make it through, grab a different badge and try again. There are many more badges, badges but we're still going to show you the ones that we've already shown. Courses. Oh, that's kind of like Kirby. That's so While cool. Others can be purchased from Poplin shops on the world map. Be sure to exchange flower coins you collect in courses for badges. I love how they kept the like um the the like the light motif and all the music. Okay, That's so people cool. Can play locally on the same Nintendo Switch system. Or your favorite character and jump into the online. If a player is defeated in local co-op, their character will float around the course as a ghost. If Instead of a bubble. If them before time runs out, they'll jump right back into action. Gotcha. Your group won't lose a life either. It's like bubbling. And just so you know, if someone is playing as a Yoshi, you can jump on their back and ride them around the course. Even if you're also playing ah! as a Yoshi. Or if you're an elephant. this curse. Ah! <laughs> yes! If you connect online, you might see other players oh. on the world and in courses. No. These are people from around the world enjoying the game in oh. real time, appearing as I guess live player shadows. Just if like it's real Mortal time, Park, but if you're defeated, you can come back to life by bumping into a live player shadow. Players can send greetings. It's like the wild the area. Even though you won't be playing together directly. You'll get to experience Why? a subtle connection with other players online Why? as you enjoy this new adventure together. Why? You can also place a standee in a course. Standees can revive ghosts, so place them in not-so-easy areas and help your fellow players. No. You can purchase standee surprises from the Poplin shops. Okay, so it is a collecting. shop. Okay. You never know which standee you'll oh, get. those are like stamps. Okay, cool. When you come into contact with an online player or their standee, you'll see their username and heart points. These points show oh how my much God, they help other players on their adventure. Reviving ghosts, gifting items. Reaching the goal. Oh no, they just made it like easy more. mode. Earn you heart points. Like, I hate this with a burning passion. While playing online, you also have the option of creating a room to Okay, get thank God. Okay, this is a little room, bit better. You can see which courses your friends are playing, enter courses together, and even race through certain courses. Start okay. Start race by hitting the race That's block. at least a little bit better, because we can kind of play with each other, but we're then also going through our own game. It. Hey, um, what's up, Ev uh, Evic? A little bit better, but I. The only way to finish a race, though. You can kind of play with each other, but you can't really interact with each other. I feel like it's better just to play local. I don't know. I have to ask the guys how they feel. I hate this with a burning passion. Like. Up with for like races. You can't. You, can your you can't directly play with each other. Well, now you want us to directly play with each other. Like, why would you say that? Like, why would you say? Oh, that was weird. I think that was the invisibility. Whoa. Captain Toad! Captain Toad in a 2D game? Yo, the little sparkies as well? Returning since Mario World? No. Yeah. Jump into the unexpected with Mario and friends Whoa. when Super Mario Brothers Wonder launches on the Nintendo Switch system October 20th. You know what? Plus, 
A new Nintendo Switch OLED model Mario Red Edition is also on Oh my the god, that's the same the one but it's OLED. Find Mario and some hidden coins. The Nintendo That's Switch the Mario OLED Red Edition model, Mario but now it's an Red OLED. Edition launches October 6th. They did it again. I think Yo. Nabbit was added. That's oh, okay.